Hi folks, I'm Steve Judd, professional astrologer with 35 years astrological experience and these are my forecasts for April 2015, brought to you courtesy of the wonderful people at AskTheAnswer.com, the UK's leading telephone chat line for things like psychics, mediums and channelers. Enjoy! And this is the astrological forecast for the sign of Pisces for uh, April 2015. And compared to recent times, compared to the last couple of months, April can be said to be a lot easier than you might hope for. Certainly February and March were times of fast action and the need to make decisions which the effects of are still echoing now. But April is a far less urgent month. A very few of you, perhaps those born on February 27, 28, 29, yes, there's an element of cloud or fog or uncertainty around you that's um, going to stick around for a few months, but you're the exception rather than the rule. Most of you are having a much more low-key time. There's no new challenges, blockages, restrictions around you. You're not going over the top. There's no sign of drama or having the rug pulled from underneath your feet. And you don't seem to be self-sabotaging yourself either. There's no reason for you to come out and play this month. There's no reason for you to suddenly take centre stage, so don't. There's every good reason for you to step a little bit back behind the scenes and become a lot more taciturn, withdrawn. Not hiding, but recharging. You're not going to be facing any type of challenge or difficulty, significant ones this month, so you don't need to have your shields up, and you can use the energy released there in recharging your battery so that when there are new challenges again in the future, you'll have full batteries to deal with them. Therefore, as far as April 2015 goes, Pisces, have a generally recharging there you go, folks. I hope that was fun and helpful. You can find out a lot more about me at my website, www.stevejudd.com. And I'll be back next month here with the forecast for May, courtesy of AskTheAnswer.com, those wonderful people who are so good to you, both you and me. Catch you next month. Bye.